In this tutorial I'm going to go over on how to change a password on a TrueCrypt volume. So we're going to need some tools. We're going to need TrueCrypt, which we have. And we're also going to need a volume. So here we have a TrueCrypt volume. And this one's from the SSS Demo Portable Apps from Big Byte Technologies to demonstrate simple security script. Let's start with TrueCrypt here. All right, so now we want to drag and drop this on here. It would be just fine. Once we have this into TrueCrypt this way, we have our volume tools down here. So I'm going to click on Change Volume Password. All right, so our current password is Portables. Just to display that for you, I'll display the password again. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And when I click OK, it's going to attempt to change the password, but it's going to give me a security warning because the password is rather short. So I don't recommend using a short password. But in this case, this is going to work fine for our tutorial. But, so there's our warning. And we're just going to click Yes and continue with that. Now at this point, it's going to go ahead and start trying to change the password, and it has to uh, do some work on the volume. So you may get this uh, not responding. But don't worry about it, just let it run for a little bit. And after um, a minute or two, depending on the size of your volume, it may take much longer. It, it just goes and fixes itself. Okay, the volume has been successfully changed. That's all we need to do. Alright, so if we went back to our start here, which mounts the volume automatically, let's we'll put in our new password. And the password is going to be 12345. OK. And there we have it. This is how you successfully change a password on a TrueCrypt volume.